بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله رب العالمين وصلى الله وسلم على نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه وسلم أما بعد أيها الأحباب Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has commanded us to be of the best ummah, to command the good and forbid the evil. So as much as you're able to, you should do so. You should call people to righteousness. You should set a good example. You should watch your tongue, watch your manners, how you interact with one another, how you interact with your brothers and sisters, how you interact with those people who differ with you in creed, in minhaj, in their mistakes. All of these things are legislated by Kitab Allah wa Sunnah to Rasul sallallahu alayhi wa sallam and the madhab of the salaf of this ummah. And the Prophet alayhi salatu wa salam said in the hadith of Sahih Muslim, the hadith of Abi Sa'id al-Khudri radiyallahu ta'ala anhu, قال سمعت رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم يقول إنما سمعت رسول الله صلى الله عليه وسلم يقول من رأى منكم منكر فليغيره بيد فإن فإن لم يستطع فباللسان فإن لم يستطع فبقلبه وذلك عرف الإيمان هو مسلم إن الحديث الذي رواه النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم هي صلوات ربي وسلامه عليه سيد Whoever sees a munkar or something evil from amongst you, then change it with his his hand. And if he's unable to do, he should. If he's unable to, he should change it with his tongue by speaking out against it. And if he's unable to do so, then he should change it with his heart. And that's the weakest form of iman, showing us that iman has different levels, and that iman has different components. That we have iman, faith in our heart. We have faith on our tongue. Saying La ilaha illallah, Shadowing La ilaha illallah, Wa Shadowing Muhammad Rasulullah, Subhanallah, Alhamdulillah. All of these are forms of illustrations of Iman. They're part of Iman. They're Aqwal ala Lisan. And that actions by taking, removing a harm from the road, this is a part of Iman. And this is a part of removing a munkar if it was something that was put there out of, uh, to, to harm people, but removing it. For the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, you're removing an evil. That's a part of Amr bi maruf and nahi al-munkar. And likewise, Ayyul Ahbab is, as the Prophet wasalam, said, it's the weakest part of Iman to hate an evil in your heart that you're unable to remove with your hand or you're unable to remove with your tongue by speaking out against it. By hating it in your heart, hating disbelief, hating uh, hypocrisy, hating sinfulness, hating that which Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala hates, all of this by hating it in your heart, then this is a part of Iman as well. And this is a part of Tagayr al-Munkar to the extent of your ability. And we have different stations in society and different uh, degrees of ability to remove a harm and to command the good and forbid the evil. And may Allah bless us to be of those who command the evil, uh, command the good and forbid the evil. May Allah forgive me. And may Allah protect us from the evil of ourselves and the evil of others. Wa sallallahu wa sallam ala nabiyyina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam.